Okay, we'll try this video again. Hopefully this time the camera's in focus all the way. I think it is. Yeah, I guess I'll post that other one up, but it's a little blurry. I grabbed another arm out. This one's this one's actually pretty bad. Not as bad as that one I did on the blurry video, but it's pretty bad. So um, I'll just do this one too. So it's swinging back and forth, as you can see. Um, it's favoring this pole right here. Looks like this little crook. So I always add the weights, by the way. I always add the weights inside the crook. There's weights here, here. I, w I wouldn't add a weight outside here because if the glue breaks, it's there's nothing to hold it on. Uh, up here inside the crook of the armature, it'll it'll stay there. Even if with, without hardly any glue support, it'll still stay there because that's supporting it from centrifugal force. So anyhow, um, this was the pole that was on the light side. So I'll just uh, take and stick a piece of tungsten in that. Let's see how I did. All right, a little better than it was, obviously. Now it's kind of favoring the entire pole, like it's like, you know, heavy or light right in the middle of the pole. But, uh, of course, I can't add weight right there um, unless I go underneath, and I don't really, I usually don't do that, so. I'll just add another, I'll add a little, geez, a little chunk of brass here, see what, see what happens. Okay, still favoring that pole, but now it's on the other side of the pole. So it looks like I would just need a little bit of, a little bit of weight on this side. So I'll kind of look through, find a small chunk of brass, stick it there. You get, you, after you do a few of these, you get a feel for how much weight you need to put on. It's, it takes practice. And by the way, if you put too much weight on at some spot, you know, it's it, the glue is wet. You could just poke it off with a toothpick and remove it. Like here, it looks like I, I overcorrected just a little bit. Now it wants to swing the other way. Just a little, maybe. Boy, it isn't much. It's pretty close. It's hard to get very excited about that amount of unbalance. It's acting like it's got a little chunk of crud on the on the arm shaft. I'm going to clean it off here with the with the compressed air and try it again. I think I'm just going to let that one go. It looks pretty good.